Today let us see no validation of HTML5 forms. No validation is an attribute. Well, why do we require no validation? In many situations, we have a lengthy form wherein users enter a lot of information and once he hits submit, due to some validation mistakes, he need to re-enter the entire things, which is kind of frustrating for the users. So we will implement two buttons where user can submit, another button where user can save his data temporarily, maybe inside a temporary database table. So in this example, I'm taking two input fields, name and age. Here I'll have a submit button as usual. I'll call it submit. Let's have a look at it in the browser. Before that, I'll make the name input that is the first input tag as required. We have already seen how this required field works. You need to enter the input or else it won't go any further. So I leave the first input field and submit. It tells please fill out this field. If I enter no validate attribute for form tag itself, it applies to all its children. So once I hit submit, it doesn't warn me of anything. It just gets submitted. That is validation doesn't take place here. I can remove this and apply it individually using form validate attribute. I'll call this as save and apply form no validate attribute. But our require attribute is still here. So once I click submit, it validates. If I click save, it doesn't apply validation rules. If I hit submit, it asks for validation, but it doesn't apply for save. So this way you can make use of no validate or form no validate attribute of HTML5. Please share this video with your friends on Facebook, Google+, LinkedIn, Twitter, StumbleUpon, etc. Like this video on YouTube.